All right, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to the Chupacabra Tutorials channel. I'm your host, Larry, and today we are checking out a new Discord music bot called Nico Music. And what this bot does differently is this is a completely open source and completely free music bot that doesn't hide anything behind either a paywall or behind a vote for us on top.gg wall in order to use all of the functions and features. And this particular bot plays music off of SoundCloud, Spotify, Bandcamp, Vimeo, Twitch, and custom HTTP streams. And it's also completely open source, so you can check it out on GitHub, and it's created by Zingy Tomato. And if you want to check this bot out for yourself, you can just head over to the top.gg page and click on the big pink invite button. From there, it should pop into your server and look like this, saying that it's looking for you to type in slash help on your server because it uses slash commands. And if you type this in, it'll give you a list of all of the commands that you can use to play music, grab lyrics, see new releases and trending music, and then ping the bot and other stuff that you can do in order to customize it and use it the way that you want. So to get these to work, most music bots like it when you hop into a sound channel, and then I'm going to have it play something off of SoundCloud, which I've got some open right here. So I'm gonna have it play, and then I'm gonna give it a link to this particular NCS song. So it's gonna play Def Keys Invincible. And then we can also continue to add more songs to the list. We'll just go slash play, we'll just type in like a name. I'll see what happens when I just tell it to add some NCS stuff to the list and it'll give me some nostalgico. And then let's say play song. So let's see what's under new releases. So let's see what's under actually trending. Trending sounds like fun. So it'll give me a list of all of the trending music right now. We've got Shivers, Stay by Justin Bieber, Heat Waves, Infinity. So let's play song infinity and that'll automatically add all of those songs to the queue and then we can just type in queue and then it'll tell us all of the songs that are coming up and then it'll also give us some buttons that we can use maybe we can use in order to play different songs in the queue but we can always type in the commands in order to skip the different music we can just type in slash skip slash replay to replay the current song. And so far outside of the bot needing a minute to think about a few things when it's searching for music across several different platforms at the same time and then adding them to the queue, I have found that the music played by Nico Music has been pretty crisp and relatively snappy. I haven't really seen a whole lot of lag. Let's see what is under new releases. So under newer releases, we have a whole bunch of stuff and I'll just say slash play song name. Uh, let's do black summer. No idea what that is, but we'll just add that to the queue for shits and giggles. And then we can type in slash skip. And then we can just skip to the next song in the queue. Uh oh. All right, well, sometimes a few hiccups are known to happen, which is all right, slash skip. All right, there we go. So it skipped past the current song, which means it's currently playing. Oh, sorry, I, I need to type in now playing in order to get the list of what is currently playing. So right now it's playing Nostalgico, and it skipped past the previous song. And next up is Infinity by James Young, followed by Black Summer by the Red Hot Chili Peppers. Actually, that sounds pretty good. I haven't listened to the Red Hot Chili Peppers new stuff in a while. Then, of course, when we're done, we can either type in pause. And that will pause the music, or if we're completely done, we can just stop the music. And then we can have it leave the channel when we are done with the bot. So basically one of the things I like about this bot is it's not full of like 50 different commands that honestly nobody's using. Cause again, I feel like most people play with things like those filters that every single bot has 
like once or twice just for fun and then it loses its mystique and then they're just using like the basic searching for music playing music start stop skip and that's about it this one also has a few other basic commands to do things like clear out the queue skip to a certain part in the song move to a different channel check out new releases and trending um then you can start stop pause resume all that stuff so I think it's a strong bot. I mean, it handles everything that you'd want to. Very lightweight, not a lot of frills and thrills to worry about. Very simplistic. And it's also open source that if you wanted to use this as a basis for developing your own bot, you probably could. So that'd be it for this one, ladies and gentlemen. This has been a brief look at Nico Music. I've been your host, Larry. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll catch you later. Bye, everybody, and have a good one.